Alright, so uh, moving forward, what we're going to do now is extend the leg from the shoe. So what I want to do first is uh, select edge mode, zoom in on here, and I'm going to double click the inside here to select it. Now I've got that selected, I can extrude it. I'm going to edit mesh and extrude. Pressing W, I'm going to click the top arrow and drag it up. I think I'm just going to press R and scale it outwards. You can see in the bottom right image, it's expanding out to meet the size of the leg. Slightly off though, so I'm just going to press W and move it over a bit, just so it lines up. So now it lines up on the right side. On the bottom left window, you can see it's slightly off, so I'm just going to center it. And I'm going to scale it again, but only in the only in the x-axis. So that way, it stays aligned in all sides. So I can look at it now. And the legs starting to come together here. I'm going to go ahead, keep going. I'm going to extrude it out again. Here's something new. I have to rotate it a little bit, so I'm going to press E, slightly rotate it. Now it's matching up a little bit better. This side here, just shift it over, scale it again. Oh, trying to scale it in the X. I'm going to extrude it again. One more time. Right here is where we have to do a little bit of guesswork. Because we're not entirely sure where the leg is going to end. A good idea is to turn on x ray so you can see at least the sides coming up. So I'm going to go ahead and scale this down to match the leg. The tide's done. Now, friend, I'm just going to move it over. Just scale it a little bit in the z axis. Move it over again. And now it's a little bit closer. I'm just going to scale it one more time to the z axis. So now we've got a tube here that looks kind of like uh, the bottom lower leg. Here, now what we're going to do with this leg is just uh, realign, just realign it a little bit. Everything else fits. The, everything else looks fine, but uh, what I want to do is I want to tighten it up a little bit. So I'm going to go into vertex mode. I'm going to select the front vertexes here. So you can see in the perspective here, I've got all the front vertexes. Selected. Now what I'm going to do is just scale them in the x-axis. Just make it a little bit more narrow because the legs aren't that flat in the front. So now you can see it looks a little bit closer to the leg now. And we'll do the same thing with the back side. Well, the back side is not that narrow, not as narrow as the front. I'm just going to select the back side here. You can see I got it selected. And I'm just going to scale it again in the back, just a little bit. Not too much, because the back of the cab is usually bigger than the front. So, as you can see, now we've got a finished leg. 